We are LMTV, Linmar Television. Linmar, your news starts now. Good morning, Linmar. It's Friday, December 4th, 2015, National Cookie Day. Here's a look at the stories making news on your Linmar campus. Our top story, it's the start of the weekend. Our team of Jeff and Erica are here with the LMTV Weekend Report. What's happening on campus this weekend? Well, guys, the big event on campus this weekend is the robotics meet. Come to the school tonight to watch 12 teams from around the area kick off the competition season. It starts at 6.30 p.m. in the main gym. In other news, Palms are at the state competition in Des Moines today. The NEIBA Honor Band plays tomorrow in Olwine. JV and Varsity Bowling <clears throat> will meet Iowa City High at Colonial Lanes. Team dismissed at 1.40 p.m. Sophomore and varsity girls basketball travels to Waterloo West. We have three new movies to tell you about. Krampus. When a young boy has a terrible attitude at Christmas, he ends up summoning something much worse than Santa Claus, Krampus. Youth. A retired composer and film director deal with the struggles of age, but come to peace with their pasts together. Macbeth. Based on the Shakespearean play, Macbeth tells the tale of a man who seeks to be king through a prophecy that was foretold. That's your weekend. Make it a good one. Becky, back to you. Thanks, guys. The Choral Department will present Get in the Spirit Saturday, December 19th. Concert times are 6 and 8. Tickets are $8 each and will be available in the cashier's office before school starting Wednesday. Any sophomore, junior, or senior interested in being a tutor in the Writing Center, pick up an application in Ms. Chico's room or in the Writing Center. Applications are due before winter break. We'll be back with more LMTV news right after this. Lion's Den Store is open this weekend. It's the only place where you can get the official Linmar gear. T-shirts, sweatshirts, shorts, and much, much more. How much more? Much, much more. Check it out this Saturday from 9 a.m. to noon. What time? 9 a.m. to noon. In the lower comments. Saturday, 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 9 a.m. to noon. See you there. Welcome back. Be sure to come in door 14 for tomorrow's Booster Club clothing sale. Juniors and seniors, if you want to keep your time release privilege, you must be passing all classes by Wednesday. Seniors, your senior photos must be uploaded by next Thursday in order to be in this year's yearbook. Now Garrett is here with sports. Thanks, Becky. In the world of Lamar sports, JV Wrestling travels to Jessup for a competition. JV and Varsity Boys Swimming will swim at Jefferson Invitational. Varsity Wrestling heads up to Independence, and sophomore and Varsity Boys Basketball travels to Bettendorf. Game time is at 5 p.m. All Metro teams are out for football. Dallas McFarland and Reese Phillips made the first team offense. Logan Hagmeyer was named first team defense. Congratulations, guys. That's sports. Becky, back to you. Thanks, Garrett. In news from the counselors, senior. seniors, check out the scholarship opportunities on the Family Connection site. New ones are being added every day. For more information on this story, stop by your counselor's office or check out their blog or website. Now Nathan joins us with the Arts and Clubs. Thanks, Becky. Are you in the spirit of giving this holiday season? Key Club is collecting canned goods for HACAP in the two corners next week. Stop by and help them out. And Interact is collecting your blood with the help of Mississippi Valley Blood Bank. The blood drive will be held Thursday. Sign up before school in the two corners. And Mrs. Fry is collecting the scripts for 101 Dalmatians. Actors who have not returned the scripts will be charged for them. The naughty list will be submitted to Mrs. Dayton in the cashier's office on Monday. Ellen Buddies will be watching a movie in the Little Theater and eating pizza on Tuesday from 3.30 to 5.30. You must RSVP to Carlson Whitford by the end of the school day on Monday. They hope to see all the Ellen Buddies there. Key Club's next meeting is Wednesday morning at 8 in the food court. And Freshman Readers Theater will, be, will meet Monday right after school in the Learning Center. That's your club update, Becky. Back to you. Thanks, Nathan. Hey, Garrett, what's for lunch? Well, today it's Pizza Hut or the Deli Bar Sandwich. In the food court, it's also Pizza Hut. That's lunch. Back to you. Thanks, Garrett. Sounds delicious. Now, Weathercaster Garrett is here with this weekend's forecast. Garrett? Well, guys, it's looking to be a pretty nice weekend this weekend. Uh, most, mostly sunny skies today with a high of about 46. When we move on to tomorrow, it will look mostly sunny with a high of about 48. Sunny looks cloudy with a high of only 42 with a possible mix of snow and showers. That's your weekend forecast. Becky, back to you. Thanks, Garrett. That wraps up today's edition of LMTV News. Remember, LMTV is always available online. 
Just go to the high school website or follow us on Twitter. For the entire cast and crew, thanks for watching. Join us again on Monday and have a fantastic weekend, Linmar.